Hi there, my name is Kaylee. My name is Shay. And we're tackling some big debt in the Big Apple. Hello and happy Friday. Hello, good morning, happy Friday. It is Friday, April 26th. It is Friday, the last Friday in April. Mm -hmm. In fact, double paycheck week, we both got paid. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna spend that. Uh, what did we do this week? Many things. We hosted my best friend from college. We did. Um, she and her fiance came over to spend the day, the weekend with us. They came over from Providence, and that was super, super fun. It was a blast, yeah. Yep. So we we spent money, but I think we spent it in a very good way. Yeah, and we didn't we didn't overspend. We spent exactly as much as we thought we would, which is awesome. Just cool. So prime. Um, and then it was work, work, work. Yeah, I went to I went to go see a show. <clears throat> That my friend was in. Oh, yeah. She was really good. Um, Very apt saying, your friend was really good, not the show was really good. Interesting choice of words there. I think that was it. And I worked from everywhere. Yeah. Met with our wedding photographer. We did. Yeah. Yes. So we spent some money this week, but it was all money that we planned on spending. Yeah. So I feel good about that. Uh, what are we planning for next week? Next week, you are going to be away. I'm going to be gone. I leave on Sunday. Yep. Going to a conference in San Diego, mm -hmm. which is, yes, where we just were. So I'm just going back and forth. Should be full. Back and forth across the country. Yep. Well, would you rather I stayed there for a whole week? No. Yeah, so. And I am going to be spring cleaning and hitting up every patio bar that exists because every. the weather is going to be so nice. The weather is going to be really nice. Yeah. But I'll be in San Diego enjoying their nice weather, so I don't yeah. feel so bad. Sometimes I get sad when I leave New York and the weather's beautiful and then I'm in like Seattle and it's raining. But San Diego. Yeah. Going to a Padres game. It'll be the second baseball game I've ever been to in my life. That was the first one. The Yankees game. That's correct. All right. Yeah. Let's get to budgeting, shall let's, we? Let's get into it. Let's get to it. Overspending. We have none. Hell yeah. Oh, man, I tried to think of a funny, weird high five to do to you, and I couldn't come up with any. Uh, we have done. We did have a little bit, I think, at one point, but we covered it throughout the week. Yes. Yeah. We, we purchased a window fan unit. Oh, I forgot that was this week, too, yeah. It's been a game changer. We're uh, we're trying to improve our the air movement in our house. Yes. Because a lot of places in New York, if you didn't already know, I feel like I say this every summer, yeah. do not have central air conditioning. No, they do So not. we just have two window units. But we've got like three main living spaces in our house, like our bedroom, the office, and the living room. Mm -hmm. And we're trying to get by with just those two units. Yes. So we got a window fan and we're going to... It's been working out well so far. It has. But it's not prime AC weather yet. No. But I, I, I feel like prime AC weather is... Imminent. Yeah. It's coming. So we'll see. We'll see. We'll see if we can make do with the two ACs and the window fan. I, I, I'm, I'm feeling good about it. Okay. Bills. Done. Done. Funded. 100%. They've been covered. funded. We've been funded. Yeah. In fact. Okay. Bills. Cats. Do we have any cat things we feel like we're going to need to buy before I leave? No. Like litter I feel good about. We got a huge, mm -hmm. a huge, Amazon, that huge Amazon box has been working out for me. Yes. Like that and then a supplementary little one for, yeah. Mm -hmm. I feel like that's working out. The food, we've got a great system going for the food. Mm -hmm. I think maybe even soon we can drop this down a little bit. Yeah. I'm kind of liking having a little buffer because the price fluctuates a little bit on Amazon. Oh, interesting. But not this much. Okay. I don't know. It's not hurting us to keep $60 rolling. It's only up to 60 It's not Yeah. It's not stacking. So, um, cat fixtures. Mm -hmm. How do you feel about putting another 535 in here and then just capping it and turning off the target for next month? That's great. You feel I good feel about that? good about Let's that. Let's do that. Yeah. Oh, wait. Hold on. We did overspending and then we skipped everything else on the list. <laughs> God, we're so, this is crazy. Uh, rent. Rent. $800 on rent. Oh, except rent is funded for next month already. So then we're going to try to get, so somebody commented and said um, that we're a month ahead on rent, which is technically true. Mm -hmm. We are funding into next month, but it comes out right on the first. So for me, it doesn't really count as being a month ahead Yeah. until we fund the next month ahead, which mm -hmm. we did start doing. We put $40 in here last week, and mm -hmm. I say we put the full 800 Yeah. Like, we are almost a month ahead. We're like halfway yeah. to being a full month ahead, a little under halfway, mm -hmm. but to being a full month ahead on rent. Yeah. 
which is awesome. So, rent, and then back to today, um, and then Wyatt. Jeez, I, we, every week, every this is just crazy. Oh, do we have the new targets for YNAB yet? I want them so so much. Yeah, yeah. Once again, I'm not up to date on the YNAB lore, and so maybe those yeah. of you who are also not up to date on the YNAB lore. Okay, okay, okay. There are certain ways that you can set your targets, and they just dropped new so it's special not, different ones. It's not, you know what's fun is it's not at all new, special, or different. Uh, it's just they changed the wording to make it more intuitive, which I think is great. Oh. I understood the old targets, but I totally saw that if you were starting with YNAB, it did not make sense. Because all of them had like a new fun name and all this stuff. And it's like, ooh, monthly savings builder, this, that, and the other thing. But for somebody coming in, you know, from an Excel budget, pen and paper budget, any other budgeting app, it didn't make a lot of sense. It was very overwhelming. So they just changed it. So now instead you just say, okay, my target, I want it to, for Wyatt, I want it to be weekly. They did add, for the date targets, they added like you could make it a weekly savings mm -hmm. builder kind of thing, which I'm hype about. Because that's what this is for me. Um, so, so weekly... I need $9 every Friday. Mm -hmm. Next month, I want to continue. I want to set aside another $9 a week. Save that. Or you can say a monthly target. I need this money by then. And next month, I want to... I'll move us so you can see. Set aside another $9 for next month. Or refill up to $9. So like mm -hmm. like for the cat food that we were just... The cat food we were just talking about, every month we want to fill up to $60. I don't need to keep stacking and saving up a bunch of money for cat food. It just costs what it costs every month. Mm -hmm. Come on, buddy. You got it. There you go. Um, so I think this is, for somebody who's like joining YNAB and setting a new thing, I think this is much, much, more, much more intuitive, intuitive yeah. which is what the complaint is that YNAB is not very intuitive to start with, which is true. It's hard. It takes a lot of work to kind of understand. Mm -hmm. Custom. Like, I just, I think this is great. So I need $9 every Friday and I want to set aside $9 a week, which they did not have a weekly savings builder before, mm -hmm. which is awesome. So prime. This is, they still don't have a bi-weekly option from what I can tell. But for me, I get paid weekly. I like my targets to be weekly. So mm -hmm. this works for me, but I know a lot of people get paid bi-weekly and they want them bi-weekly. So mm -hmm. we'll see. This, I, I think this is great. I'm very excited about it. It makes very little difference, if, except for these in these particular moments, mm -hmm. where I want it to be that. So I'm excited. I need nine dollars every Friday next month, and I said save target. And we just put that. I should have I should have done that first before I put the nine dollars in there. That's okay. Because I put the nine in there, right? Yes, you did. Okay. So, yeah, because nine times four is thirty-six. That's math. Um, so now, when we go next month. Five dollars, or nine dollars every single week. Nice. That makes me happy. Yay! <sighs> Why not? They got me for life. All right. Back to this. <laughs> we skipped everything, bro. Uh, so funny. Okay, so we were going to put five dollars and thirty-five cents, which is more than we need for this month, really. But now it's at a hundred, which is where we want to cap it. Mm -hmm. And so then I'm going to. Is the target already off? Did I already turn the target off on this? I must have it because I was thinking about this. Mm. Sometimes I just stare at the budget throughout the week and think about things. Yeah, she really does. I really do. So let's go Did forward. Are we yes. going to check snoozed categories? Oh, it is the last um, It's the last week of the month. Yeah. So you're right. There is. So we have other things I can hear. This is our checklist. So this is not, I was looking at regular week. You're right. It's not like regular week. It's the last week of the month. Mm -hmm. What do we do this week? We talked about that. What are we doing next week? We talked about that. I think we should do a video about like our weekly YNAB process. Like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, we do this. Friday morning, we do this. You know? Yeah. Because yeah. um, this is part of it. Uh, we covered rent. We covered Wyatt. Cover the first check snooze categories. And then at the very end, after we funded everything, is our savings goals. Mm -hmm. So cover the first first through the seventh so this is for next week oh yeah look at that so all of that adds up to 183.75 we'll mm -hmm. just fund all that because that's all the money that's coming out 
Well, I think that's actually a little farther ahead than before I get paid again. Just a scotch. Yeah, but like whatever. Yeah. Oh no, fine. we're our bills are too funded. Oh no. Oh. Um, <laughs> so the third is when I get paid again, but um, having it done through this is it's one extra bill. Yeah. And it's three dollars. So that's fine. We'll survive. Yeah. We will survive. Um, and then snoozed categories. Anything that we snoozed throughout the month, it was clothing. Mm -hmm. If we unsnooze it, we just unsnooze it. Yeah. That's that's what it was. Is throughout the month, if we transfer money out and then snooze it, because mm -hmm. and then because like I don't know if we're gonna come back to it or not. I'm fine with adding this into the funding that we need to do right now. Yeah. Are yeah, because still our, our underfunded is less than what we have ready to assign. Yeah. So, so I, I want to fund this, fund that twenty one fifty six again, which we stole to cover some of our overspending we had throughout the throughout mm -hmm. the month. Um. Yeah. Okay. So life things four twenty six eighty one, mm -hmm. clothing, haircut, transportation, booze, ordering food. Funding tickets, all that stuff. You want to mm -hmm. fund all of these things? I don't know that we need to fund transportation that much right now. How much do we have left on the card? Pause. $90. Okay. I also think that maybe we should fund transportation because we are going to a birthday party in Brooklyn, mm -hmm. deep, deep Brooklyn, and we may want to treat ourselves to a mm -hmm. car ride back. Great point. Okay, so we'll fund it for now, mm -hmm. and then if next month we're like, we had way too much in transportation, we don't need that. Oh, no. Yeah. Um, okay, so that's life funded. Yeah. It's only $40 for Pretty House. Yeah. Shay has not, still not spent a ton of pretty house money. I know. She bought a small box to put candles in. I did. And her usual flowers at Trader Joe's. Yes. But you got, like, you're building up here. I know. Oh, speaking of, is this on a builder? Set aside another $40 each month. Yes. Mm -hmm. So that's good. We want it to build up over time. Yes. Which sweet. makes sense. What... Okay. thirty sixty seven to fund career things. Mm -hmm. Actors access on track. You've got some money building up in dance class if you'd like to... I know. Take a dance class. Take a dance class. Yeah. Lexi Super. keeps trying to get me to go take a dance class with her, and I feel like that is very correct of her. <laughs> <laughs> All right. 190 in Sync the Funds. Mm hmm Yes. Yes. It's all funded. Start building dental back up again next, mm -hmm. next month. Yeah. Gifts and giving. When is Liv's birthday? February. Oh, so we, we missed, missed it. So, so this, I, I put the little thing we bought for her in giving because it isn't going to be a birthday gift then. So that feels accurate then. Yeah. Um, yeah. I will probably want to bring a bottle of wine to Ariana's birthday though. Well, we've got birthday gift money. Yeah, we do. Um, that's all caught up, which makes sense because there's no overspent. Mm -hmm. Travel. Okay. So here's the thing. Yes. Oh, we only have fifty dollars left anyway, so whatever. But yeah. travel, we technically did not fund this month. I don't think we mm -hmm. just spent out of this, so it makes it look. Also, we can delete this. Goodbye. Um, I didn't think about what doing all the spending out of this line would mean because we didn't technically fund the three hundred dollars, but we will next month when we mm -hmm. do this. Yeah, we'll put fifty in there now, and then we'll keep working. Keep working on it. Just put fifty. Right, I'm gonna put fifty right in here because yeah. that's where it needs to go. Put the fifty ninety two. Yeah. Boom. And that's everything. And that's everything. Wow, that's beautiful. Yeah. Okay, so next step on the checklist was savings goals. Mm -hmm. So the challenge this month was no eating out. Yes. So our eating out budget, ordering food, is fully funded. And not at all spent. And not at all spent. We did it. Dude, I want pizza so bad. No. But we have a couple more days left. We do. But I think we move this money right now. Yeah. 
to the student loans yes. transferred over. So that we are not tempted to spend. To student loans. Are we in the way? Yes. Boom. And then I'm going to snooze this so it doesn't yell at me. And then I'm going to transfer that on my phone right now. I'm so proud of us. I know we did such a I good job. I thought for sure we were going to slip up. We didn't break even a little bit. I did. We did cheat. I think we did cheat a tiny bit. Just a scotch. And I mean, we spent date night money on eating out, which was a wonderful meal. But like we went out and that was date night. It was a double date with our friends. Mm -hmm. And then I bought a fun little drink with my fun money. Yes. I also bought a fun little drink and a slice of pizza with my fun money. Yeah. $250 extra on the student loans. That's awesome. That makes me really think about how much we spend on ordering food throughout the month and how much we could be putting to the student loans instead. Well, I think that... You're like, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> that was I not think, the point of this. I think that that's the, the, that's the point of these is just to, you know, make us a little self-aware. Mm -hmm. um, but I also feel like it's good to have a, a rotating challenge because I could not redo April no. for several months in a row. No, I don't think I don't think I don't think the answer is zero, but I do wonder if maybe that's a sign that we can absolutely take this down a little bit. I think I think maybe in June we can have like a, a mid year check in with where our targets are. And see oh, if what if we can't okay. dig through and maybe find a little bit more like yeah. an extra hundred dollars in different categories and shave some stuff down. Yeah, that's a nice Tuesday video. And then yeah, and then we can like you know shave it down here, there, and other places, mm -hmm. and um, maybe then you know make that adjustment in my paycheck, the deposit elsewhere. Yeah. Um, speaking of, let's look through the other categories and see if there's not something else we want to send on over the student loans while we're here. Mm -hmm. You down with that? I don't know if it'll be a ton, but like at the end of the month, maybe we just do a little sweep, see if there's some stuff we know. Uh, bills, I don't think we should sweep. Mm -hmm. um, this we just sent over. I'll do one big transaction to so do a. Okay, so bills, no. Cat stuff, probably also no. Yeah. Unless we want to send this. I don't. I don't think that's no? necessary. Okay, um, we've got 12.46 left in date night. Or do we want to let that roll? I think we let it roll. All right. It might be nice for a little slice of pizza or something. Okay, we've got $82 left in booze. I think we can sweep 30 of that. That's what I'm thinking, 30-ish, 30, 30 yeah. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to snooze that so it doesn't yell at us. I don't like it when it's mad at me. I'm doing it on purpose. Um, tickets we're saving up for mm -hmm. 17 cents. Um, sinking funds slash funds. Travel. Okay. Yeah. All right. So 30, 30 other 30, bucks. An extra 30 other bucks? Yeah. I'm going to transfer that right now and then we'll enter all that in. And there we go. Sorry, by the way, that we didn't make a Tuesday video. Oh yeah, we didn't. We didn't make a video on Tuesday. We were uh, tired. Yeah, <laughs> that's all I got. We Kaylee just... was sick. Yeah. Yeah. She's finally feeling better now. Two hundred and eighty bucks. That's pretty good. That is pretty good. Uh, yeah, I was feeling sick. I was just really tired. I was working out of the house a lot this week, and we just, you know. We were tired, and we did not have a very good idea on what to do. No. Uh, so we just, you know, we realized it was happening, and we were like, "Not today." <laughs> we'll try to. I'm gonna try to come up with something to do for this next Tuesday, but I also don't have any ideas on that. <laughs> We've been busy. It was a very busy season of life. Yes. Um. And it's going to continue to be busy. It's going to continue to be busy, but I do I do like posting the Tuesday videos. So, mm -hmm. you know, the Fridays we, we stay very consistent with because we're going to sit down and do this anyway. Mm -hmm. uh, but, you know, the Tuesdays are a little tougher. So I guess drop in the comments if we've got any ideas. 
yeah, always looking for suggestions. Yeah. Yeah. Woohoo. Yeah. All right. So, 187.50 is what is planned. I'm going to just underfund it. I know. So, 392.50 is all extra from this month from various sources from our challenge from the buy me a coffee for fam from like all kinds of stuff. So 39250 extra this month. And the goal original goal was like an extra $200 a month gets us there by the end of the year, right? Yeah, 250 or yes, 200. Yeah. So we're we're trucking along. We are trucking. All 580 on 15. Mm -hmm. Look at that. All right, 580, all on student loan 15. Submit. Heck yeah. yeah. That is cool. All right. Let's move us up here so we can really see this. March 2025, current payoff date. The goal, December 2024. I want to make sure this is all as legit as possible. The current down to the penny actual oh my gosh <laughs> driven crazy is 5566.35 so it went up four bucks less than four bucks yes yes okay everything's that's exactly as it is right now mm -hmm. at this moment I'm feeling stress for no reason. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> we can do it. We're literally so close. Mm -hmm. Hold on, I want to look at um the payoff simulator. Okay. So right now, five thirty-two is what we're doing. It's only an extra hundred. Heck yeah. Like, no question we got this. Yay! That's gonna be good. I might, I'm gonna go into the six, I'm gonna, 642. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go in and make that the target so that way we know what we're shooting for. Does that make sense? Mm hmm. There it is. Or is it more fun when it goes down? I think for you it's more fun when it goes down. Mm, you're right. Okay, I need to write this down somewhere. Um, I'll put it in the name of the loan. Because you're right. When it like knowing where we're at and then watching it go down is very fun for me. Mm -hmm. We're making it happen. Oh, we are so near. Yeah. Woo. All right. Yeah. Heck yeah. I think we got this. I yeah. really do. Especially if we keep doing that little sweep at the end. <coughs> Sorry, what was that? <coughs> okay. Okay. Good week. I feel like I need a nap. I need breakfast. <laughs> really good week. Really solid week. I think we can make this happen. I really do. I feel good about it. Yay. That's good. I'm signing off. I'm not doing thumbs up. Okay. Um, all right. We're going to go. Do have, I need to make breakfast? We're going to go have breakfast. Um, another great month. Inching well ever closer to the wedding. <gasps> it's coming. It's going to be so fun. I'm so yeah. excited. Okay. We're going to go. Have a wonderful week. And we will. I'm really going to try. We will hopefully see you Tuesday. Yeah. <laughs> we're really tired. But we love you guys so much. And we yes. love making content. And it's a good time. So <laughs> thanks so much. We'll see you soon. Yay. <laughs> Bye.